A lot of Mainers vote absentee, and in this presidential election year, even more are expected to be mailing their ballots in. But will all of those votes be counted? Good evening, everyone. I'm Brian Yacono. And I'm Amanda Hill. That's the question at the center of a letter sent to the U.S. Postmaster General from Maine Secretary of State Shanna Bellows, as well as many of her counterparts across the country. As News in Maine's Rai Wooten has learned, they are concerned that continued mail delays could lead to disenfranchised voters if those problems are not fixed right away. Americans depend on the U.S. Postal Service for timely delivery of the mail to every corner of the country. But according to Shanna Bellows and secretaries of state across the country, as well as local election officials, Americans aren't receiving the quality of service they deserve from the U.S. Postal Service. What we're seeing is that election officials are sending out election mail to voters and it is being returned as undeliverable even when the address is correct. Bellows says mail is also taking long periods of time to deliver sometimes not reaching its destination until 10 or more days past the postmark date. Bellows believes issues like this could prevent voters from having their absentee ballots counted this presidential election. Perhaps it's a lack of training or some of the steps that uh, the Postal Service's management has made to consolidate processing and resulting in potential errors. Secretaries of state from all 50 states and local election officials took action Wednesday, sending a letter to the Postmaster General, laying out their concerns again with ongoing postal service problems. In a statement, USPS spokesperson Marty Johnson wrote, We have been in close communication with the National Association of Secretaries of State and the National Association of State Election Directors, as well as other election officials throughout the year. Each time they have brought any issues to our attention, we have promptly addressed those concerns. It's very But Bellows says it's she it's hasn't seen improvement. Every voter should know that when they return their ballot, their ballot will be returned in a timely way and their vote will count. Johnson says as a common sense measure, voters should mail their completed ballot at least one week prior to their state's absentee ballot deadline. We are sounding the alarm to the U.S. Postal Service at the highest levels. And they're hoping progress comes before Election Day. In Portland, Ryan Wooten, New Center, Maine. And as a reminder, all absentee ballots in Maine must be in the hands of town and city clerk's offices by 8 p.m. on Election Day or they will not be counted.